Shalom Chabrim, I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Dunoon Institute of Biblical Research. I am actually standing on no doubt what should be considered the holiest ground in all of Jerusalem here. What you're seeing right here behind me, and I'll be sharing with you the images of this here, this is actually kept inside concrete walls with a secure door and everything on Mount Zion. This is the entrance to St. James's Church. This is where the artifacts that were actually found here of the Messianic seal. This is the place where Israel and even the Catholic Church has tried to keep this hidden from the Jewish people. They didn't want them to know about this. Why? Because it links the Star of David to the early Christians as well. You're actually seeing him behind you here. This is where uh, it was actually, uh, I believe there was a baptismal pool as well, but this is the very grounds of St. James is the very brother, the biological brother of Jesus. This is his, his church here. This is what he was over. This is on Mount Zion. And I've been walking around, we've been looking for this for days, wondering where is this at? And I'm gonna show you around so you can get a feel for this because this has been hidden hidden from the people here and it's so beautiful because I'm here right now as the sun is setting in Jerusalem here on Mount Zion here at the very place I have looked for here and I can't wait to share some of the footage here with you you'll be seeing it here even as you're watching this it's to me it's the most remarkable occasion my heart is just filled with joy I mean it's like the anointing is here because you know at St. James had a church here no doubt I'm walking on the ground where Yeshua walked at. I am, I am in the place looking at the steps in behind me here where we know for a fact Yeshua, the early apostles, uh, James himself, actually walked down these steps. Peter, when he would come to see St. James, he came right here. And this is just unbelievable. And by the way, I shared a video with you guys too that, of, of, a, of a place uh, in, in Israel here where they actually had the name of Yeshua written there on the steps there. Uh, I'm gonna take you to that as well very soon, but I, I, I just, I'm, I'm ecstatic because I haven't even looked at this place yet myself because what I did is when I, I've been walking around, walking through the little houses here, places you're really not supposed to be at, you know? And then I saw this one iron, huge iron wall, but the door had been left open. And then I just walked in, and as soon as I walked in, I knew where I was at. I'd seen the pictures before of this place, and it is a blessing. God bless you all. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting this ministry as well. We thank you so much. We love you. If you want to know more about this ministry, go to IsraelReturns.com there. You can support the ministry if you would like, but I, my heart is overwhelmed, friends, overwhelmed. And I'm gonna get you a sunset picture as well so you can see it here on this particular little broadcast here. I was just doing a news clip on, on top of uh, uh, the David's tomb there, the, the upper room where the Last Supper was at. And no doubt the Last Supper was really close to this spot. So that may very well be that spot there. And this place is locked up. I'll show you that. It's locked up. They don't want nobody going in there. But the Messianic seal, you'll see the images here on your screen, the Messianic seal that was found, the artifacts, there was a drove of them found here. Now we're gonna try to make plans to go interview uh, the one man that they were given to. We're gonna try to go interview his wife because that man died. And so did the, the old monk that died, was like 94 years old. He was killed here uh, at this very place there. They killed him because they didn't want this stuff to get out. But it's incredible. Let's take a look around. I'm Stephen Benoon with uh, Dunoon Institute of Biblical Research. Shalom.